Good morning, everybody. Hope you're having a wonderful Saturday. This is about as close to a tree as you're gonna get out here in the desert. Pretty cool looking. It's like literally stands out compared to everything else if you look around. There's the campground that I'm staying at, and there's Dharma right there at the end. And of course, I'm at um, Chiriaco Summit. It's very bright right now, it's early and I'm still kind of tired. But I thought I would do a video real quick about something that's very important. <sighs> Self-esteem. All part of loving yourself. Where to begin? Self-esteem. <sighs> not talking down to yourself. Not thinking that you're not worthy of somebody when you are. That's what it is. It's self-doubt. It's stinking thinking about yourself. That keeps yourself from loving yourself and loving others because I'm sure there's somebody out there you're dying to love and talk to but you just don't have the courage because you think you're not worthy or whatever it's not true it's just your insecurities talking you out of happiness you know it's um, self-destructive behavior it's self-sabotaging I've done that before myself plenty of times where you didn't, I didn't think I was good enough. And so I didn't ask, I didn't talk to somebody that I should have, maybe. I mean, everything happens for a reason, but fortune favors the bold, right? Like, I'm nobody, but if somebody was wanting to talk to me but didn't think they were good enough, I'd think that was ridiculous because nobody's too good for me or, or I'm not too good for anybody. You know what I mean? And I'm just like some homeless dude living in my vehicle. <laughs> so, you know, I'm an artist. I'm a fun guy, whatever. But, I mean, I love myself, but I'm not arrogant. And, you know, my ego's not running amok. Narcissism, that's the word. I'm not a narcissist. I, I'm just happy to be who I am. And happy not to, you know, have that stinking thinking anymore. My whole life, I've been special, and everybody knows I've been special. But what they did was they put me down instead of uh, lifting me up. Instead of encouraging me when they saw talent, the opposite would happen. Maybe because of their insecurities. They didn't want somebody else shining when they couldn't shine. It sucks, but people are like that. I mean, I'm not sure about that self-esteem issue. There's, that's just, some people are assholes. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna sugarcoat it. There are just bad people in the world. Those guys. When I got stabbed in the back, they weren't. Those weren't Girl Scouts. Those were assholes that were looking to kill me. Not everybody's a good person in this world. But you are. And I want you to be happy. And I want you to love yourself. And I want you to know that you're good enough. And to quit thinking that you're not, because it's bullshit. I mean, I, I can't wait to, to fall in love, to be with somebody, but I'm not gonna, if I find somebody, if I know somebody I wanna be with, I'm not gonna hesitate. I'm gonna let them know. If I get shot down, I get shot down. I mean, there's free will. There's always free will for people to say no. I mean, if you're interested in somebody, get to know them, just ask them out. Just say, look, I'd like to have phone conversations, pen pals, whatever, you know. It doesn't have to start humping, you know. I mean, for the love of God. Especially now when they got diseases that just don't go away. You can't get a <laughs> you can't get a shot and it'll go away. They got they got lifetime gonorrhea or syphilis or whatever. It's, anyway, and you wonder why I'm a monk. For me it's been what, eight eight years since I've been with somebody, a woman. I'm not judging, but you know, I prefer vagina. But yeah, it's been a long time and I am not jumping back in the game. You know, like some drunken prom date. I'm, I'm looking for forever. I'm gonna fall in love and I'm gonna get married. And that's gonna be the end of it. Romantic, right? And you deserve to fall in love and you deserve to get married or not, depending on what you want. But yeah, just love yourself, okay? Because you deserve it, you're worthy. And wow, that's right. Anyway, desert, go figure, right? Anyway, 
I love you, God loves you, and the universe loves you. Don't be a chicken shit. Make the call. Call them, text them, do what you gotta do. You're good enough. And if they don't see that, fuck them. There'll be somebody that will. Trust me. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.